All right, guys, welcome back to the next video on the channel. And today, what we're going to be talking about is Sustainability Week in Pokemon Go. This event is going to be happening on Monday, April 22nd at 10 a.m. all the way up till April 26th at 8 p.m. Now, the bonuses during this event are as follows. You'll have an increased frequency of po uh, buddy Pokemon bringing you presents and gifts. Your buddy will spend more time on the map, which is really interesting for using your puffins to get walking stats, things like that. But not only that, the distance for your walking hearts will be halved. That is huge. So if you like me and you don't have any best friends on the game, you will be able to up your heart rate for that a lot easier. So I'm going to be trying to get all three hearts on maybe 10 Pokemon a day. Um, it may seem like hard to do, but hopefully like most of them I'll do is probably like one or two kilometers. So half in that makes it a lot easier. Um, but moving on from that, let's look at the Pokemon that are in this event and are featured. So you do have Combi, Drillbur, Trubbish, Boongus, and Binacle. Now these are going to be in 2k eggs. These are going to be a higher chance of getting a shiny from 2k eggs. So definitely worth it um, if you do have any any chance and any incubators in your box you can always use to try and get a shiny combi which is very difficult to get however it has been featured in the past two events as well and um, you've got drillber who has been featured in shadow events but this is a good chance to get some candy and um, fungus as well being shiny and um, it's kind of a newer one that I haven't got either so i'm looking forward to getting that but i will say one thing i do wish they'd recycle the pokemon better um, obviously, with it being spring, um, Combi is going to be out a lot more because there's bees coming out, things like that. So it does fit the season. I just wish the Pokemon would recycle better rather than having it for three seasons in a row. Um, field research tasks, there isn't any information on these at the minute, but you will be able to encounter all five of the Pokemon up here. So that's always worth it. And there is going to be a collection challenge around it for Stardust XP. Um, but there's no thing on what that is yet. I'm guessing it'll be Combi, uh, Vespiquen, Drillbur, Excadrill, and so on and so forth for all the rest of the Pokemon. I believe there's something else as well that's missing from here. I think in Pokestops it's all going to be themed like normal. Yeah, sorry, that's a bit I missed out here. Um, so you'll probably get a lot of Vespiquens in showcases, things like that. So definitely if you have any good ones from this event, Definitely keep them and have them ready to go to get in first place in all them. But thank you all for watching this video. I know this has been a short one. It is just a quick one to go over the event. And um, Tomorrow is going to be a PvP video. Play in the Jungle League. I don't really have the Pokemon for Master League yet. So we are going to skip that one. But we are looking to do more PvP on the channel. I'm also thinking of starting to stream PvP too. So let, let me know what your thoughts are down below. We will look into doing that sometime soon. Um, I'm going to try and get used, more used to the camera being there. And then we can look at doing that in the future. But it will be coming soon. So definitely keep an eye out. Uh, please subscribe to the channel if you are new. Like I say, comment down below if you think the event's going to be good. And if you have any tips on overlay styles for news event, like the news videos at the minute. So... If you look at the video now, you've got the camera in the corner and then just one big screen for the information. What I want to start adding to all my videos is a bit for my phone. So you can see a raid while you're watching the video, things like that. Just to give you more of more content while also looking at the information because just reading off a screen can be boring. So definitely give me an idea on what you think of that. And also like the video and I'll speak to you all in the next one.